Welcome back. Students at the Lansing Barber College are speaking out tonight after months of frustration. Students tell News 10 they haven't been in the classroom learning the ins and outs of cutting hair since June, leaving their education in limbo. News 10's Tania Jordan has the story. The Lansing Barber College and its new location on the city's south side with a sign saying they'll be open soon. We unfortunately had to close and move locations at the very start of June. They told us two weeks at first that we were going to be closed down for two weeks. So, you know, I, I didn't expect much, but two weeks came by. We, you know, asked for updates and stuff and owner kind of like shrugged us off a little bit. A message that students like Noah Guerrero and Ellen Gonzalez want to see happen sooner than later. It's been three months and me and 23 other students have been left in the dark about when we're going to return, how we're going to return, who to talk to about where to go. I thought I was going to be done. I had my life, you know, set and plan and stuff. A plan that was placed on hold as the Barber College lacks a key component, according to its owner, Marcel Mayberry. We are missing instructors. We are currently looking for instructors. And until we find instructors, the state will not allow them to run. Facility. Mayberry says they've completed the construction in city and state certifications. They're now working, Mayberry says, to rectify the situation by giving students their transcripts if requested and finding new qualified instructors to teach them. I understand the students. I, I want to help them. I definitely think we all want to go back to finishing our education. I, I, I have so much to learn myself. In Lansing, Tanaya Jordan, News 10. If you or someone you know has a barber instructor license, the Lansing Barber School may have a job for you. We do have information on how to contact the owners on our website, WILX.com.